I will be getting ladies and gentlemen another train video. I apologize for the late upload, but I've been super busy for the last week. Pretty much between my main job, it's been crazy. You know, my part time job been crazy, but you know what? Just had to get in the gym, even though I had to train home. If you can see, it's all the week off by actually doing my bench push session at home. So you can see here, I did regular bench press, warming up, and then of course, I did some heavier set slings, as you can see right here. And I found out that, yeah, TSA is not the best program for me because I found out by eliminating some of the vertical pulls I know to do, that put a lot of wear and tear on my shoulders. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna handle this part of the meet that's coming next year the same way I had my bodybuilder beat. Sorry, my physique competition last, earlier this year, which would be do what I know works best for me in regards to building strength and size. And this time, mostly just strength because I'm trying to, just, you know, build my strength and bench. Yeah, look and squat versus trying to do what everyone else says needs to work or will work or all this other mess. If it, ain't, if it ain't broke, don't try to fix it. Bench, I know the best thing works for me is pyramid sets, five by five, and of course there's different types of bars and resistance like the bands and chains, but mostly five by five drop sets. And of course, you can see the I'm using right there, as well as doing on the same day as doing the fiddle rope to kind of move it. Of course, the other direction as well as some pull ups. And definitely some lat pull downs, especially doing some neural lot work and keep the shoulders healthy. And definitely make sure I keep doing the facials. But anyway, let me shut up and get back to those routines. As you can see, after doing all those push movements with a regular flat bench, I went side right into doing some fiddle rolls, three sets, pronated, and three sets suminated. And I make sure I'm bending out a little bit more to make sure I'm definitely hitting my lats and not turning these two ugly, uh, ugly, messed up shrugs, but actually real rolls. And of course, I'm doing some pulling in there. I said to go ahead and really master my push movements by actually laying down and doing some floor press you can see right here in my power rack so I'm like you know I have a power rack at home I'm yoga mat I'll take advantage of both so I decided to go ahead and just rip out 185 then 225 and I actually started 225 because I'm not even gonna lie to you even though they pulled 275 off the rock with the slingshot off the ground that was not moving and I feel like messing with the slingshot again so you know what let me just wrap up this 225 as you see right here in the clip for moving on to the other exercises in the day. And I was just wraps up the footage I have for this day. And then the next day, of course, was leg day at Mind and Muscle Gym. Okay, as you can see here, this is my first time trying out the crazy safety bar they have at Mind and Muscle. And I did not show you the first set that I did or my heavier set because my form was way, way, way off. So I'm showing you pretty much what I did was I did 135, then I did 225, 225 was crazy, super crazy on the stabilizer and everything. So I was like, you know what? It was just found the 185, so I did 185 for three reps of eight to 10 reps. Sorry, 10 reps each. As you can see right here, this is my third and final set because I had issues trying to get the camera to focus properly on the first set. The second set had point in, in the wrong direction as well and so I'm part of my fight. And of course the last set when I'm super tired is when I get everything but fortunately my form did not look super jacked up. If you guys saw on Instagram I also agree with anyone right doing this. I decided to go ahead and just as one and only Deadpool and knock out some Deadpools with the hex bar as you can see right here. And yes I was still enough to wear the mask because this was the day right before Halloween. And you guys know as soon as crazy as I am, had to wear the full Deadpool outfit on Halloween day as it is. You can see right here in this clip. So if you guys are on Instagram now, it's the LA Fitness the following day on Halloween. And I had to wear full Deadpool gear. And as far as I made it, it's the pool day. Get it? Deadpool. So I did some bit on rolls with some machine and ride the boys with some curls. So you can see I like to do it always with the pronated and supinated. And the super shot, I just super set them. And I did about three sets of both. And then, of course, I'm right doing three sets of regular bicep and curls. And, of course, this is LA Fitness. It got super crowded and kind of hard for me to record in there. So, yeah, you're just going to see me doing the bit on rolls 
and then of course about to throw because it seems it was really easy for me to set the camera in a suitcase and of course later on in the week which is today Friday I decided to finish up my whole cooking routine for the week by doing some arms so as you can see here I'm up there doing some super set crazy sets right here doing some girls sorry curls for the girls in the freaking cable machine and I got to give a props to my buddy Frito doing a good out job moving the camera around so you guys get good angles all over the place and once again I apologize for the Instagram cropped images in the later half of this video but you know what it is what it is you're in the gym trying to get a pump in but also get some good footage so yes you can see here we're both biceps and triceps and also apologize for the lack of Deadpool costume at this point but you know what it's now November 3rd ain't no point in doing it but Warrior Fit, I am wearing your gear, and you can see it right here, and you can see the cuts and veins all in the arms. So right doing that, we decided to go ahead and pull around and do super heavy curls. You can check out more footage of the curls actually on Instagram on all of our pages. I posted that earlier today, and of course I finished off with my fatality tricep set right at the end. Alright, and after this fatality, uh, these three fatality sets, I was done. And today I finally signed up for a Delta Only Meet at the end of the year. So yeah, I finally am going to do a part of the meet. I actually managed to get one in before the deadline ends. Or if you feel like you got some of us, please break from subscribe. The next time, keep looking strong and peace out.